kiss for you. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development. And so, guys, this will be the part five of my video series on online music player app using Firebase in Android Studio. Alright, guys. So here I I have done the code for the admin app in which uh, we can easily upload the songs to our Firebase uh, database and also the Firebase storage. So here. I had missed uh, a part here yes so here we can now check if the song is already getting uploaded so we don't need to upload it again okay so here we can check if m upload task is not equal to null and m upload task dot is in progress okay so if it is in progress then we can say toast uh, yes, song upload is already in progress and inside our else part so we can now write the code for the song upload. Alright guys, so let's try to run the app and before that let me see, okay, so yes now our app is ready to run so here i have connected my phone and it is the real device which i am using that is the that is running on audio Alright, so now the app is getting installed on my phone. And now you can see that our app is now ready. So here we have the song title. So let's say I have the title as my song title. And okay, so also let me open the Okay, so here we can open our uh, Firebase console so that I show you the values which are getting stored in our Firebase storage and as well as the Firebase database. So here we will uh, sign in. Okay, so it is asking me for my uh, email address and now we can go to console okay so here I will open the my firebase tutorials and here inside our database and also let me open the file based storage and click on getting started and for the rules we need to change the file based rules and let's here write file based storage rules public and You, okay, so you just need to let me see if I only need this. Now read and write. And also we just need to
let me open it again okay so it is allowing me for the read and write all right so here let's now run our app here uh, okay so i will upload first of all here create the database in the test mode and now we can upload our song and from there we will be able to pick our song so let's just select okay so i will i am selecting this over the horizon and I click on done and there you can see over the horizon and if I click on upload so here now our app is crashed so let's see where the app is crashed I think I have not initialized the M storage reference. Yes, there you go. So we need to have the M storage reference. All right. So for that, you need to go to your on create method and here we can say m storage ref equal to my storage dot get instant dot get reference dot child and here we will also write songs all right so now we will run our app and let's see if it works or not Okay, so now the app is running and uh, let me enter over the horizon and let's pick uh, a file and here we will we will pick and let's say I use like this over the horizon and now I click on upload and you can see that uploading is great and there you can see the song is being uploaded to the Firebase database and there you can see that now the file is successfully uh, yes it is successfully uploaded and let me see here inside your Firebase database this is the source uh, node and inside that we have the unique key and inside that we have the song duration and the song link and that link is not where the what we we were desiring and uh, then we have the song title all right so i think i have uh, done some mistake in my song link so let's see where is the song link uh, yes okay and uh, upload song let me see where it is yes so there was the mistake so inside our own success method where is my mouse yes so what uh, there is a mistake so here inside my own success method I have to write the storage reference dot get download URL dot add on success listener new on success listener and inside this listener we are we have got this uri so here we can say uri.2 string so now we can just 
cut all those and paste it here and instead of this audio uri we will have the uh, uri and now it will upload and it will update the so let me again remove from here and also let's remove the file from our file based storage so that is our storage part but there i show you that in after this song so you can see we have got this song so let me delete it from here and let's run our app again and let's see the output now yes now that uh, we have the song title so we say over horizon and we try to upload the song and if we upload it let's say let's see if it okay so here we have the over the horizon and we click on uh, pick and now we can upload it so you can see uploading please wait and in the meanwhile inside our uh, database let me show you <coughs> sorry guys so yes here you can see now we have the url of our song here and the song the title so now let's try to upload the song again so just close app and uh, open the app again and here we have the second song and if we click on upload song then we can pick it from our let's see So here let's just open all right and now we can click on upload and there you can see uploading please wait and now you can see that it is successfully uploaded and if we click on here so you can see the it is uh, uploaded with the song duration then also we have this and the read title so if we go to our storage part uh, or i mean the file based storage so there you will see that the both the songs files are present here all right so now guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe so my in my next part of the video series i will be teaching you on how to fetch these two files or as many uh, mp3 files as Okay. Alright guys, so if you like the video, please like, share and subscribe. Goodbye.